Hello, how are you going everyone? This, this is Crypto Simplified. In today's tutorial, I'll be showing you how to send over some of your crypto from Binance Smart Chain over onto Harmony um, because I'm going to be using DeFi Kingdoms. So it's not too difficult. First of all, what you need to do is set up your MetaMask RPC. All right, and that's really simple. Just go on over to docs.harmony.1. Okay, I'll leave the link in the description. And here's a complete tutorial on how to do that. Okay, so first of all, just uh, go into your MetaMask. Okay, and drop, drop down. And you're going to click on Add Network. Okay. Then after that, all you need to do is add in this information here. Okay. Just type in all that information. So go on and into your MetaMask, click that, click on Add Network, and then just add all that information into here, and then click Save. Very, very, very simple process. Okay, and now you're on, uh, now you're actually on Harmony. What you want to do, you'll need to send over some of your tokens from Binance Smart Chain. So what you need to do is go to the bridge. All right, and I, I was just experimenting early on, and I found the easiest way. So first of all, you want to click on Docs, okay, and click on this little character over here, the Doc Master. And what I did is I clicked on Harmony Bridge, okay. And from here, what you need to do is you want to click on Binance, Binance, okay, and here from Binance to Harmony 1. All right. So, now what you need to do is okay, so you'll need to change your network to Binance. Okay, and now your MetaMask should be connected. All right. And select your BIP20. Okay. Now you need to select your token you want to use and BUSD seems to be quite a lot of liquidity for BUSD so I'll be selecting that and it says here I have 1497 available but because this is a test run I always 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 recommend doing a little bit first okay because if it's not successful and you made a mistake always do a test run it's never a bad thing all right so I'm going to be putting just sending the ten dollars at, at the start and I'm going to, uh, the one address, the receiver's address, I'm going to be using my current address. Okay, and I'll just click on use my current address and just double check that's the right one. Yep, it is. Okay, so I'm just sending over, I'll send over $20. $20. Okay, click continue, confirm it. Okay, and continue, and confirm, and my MetaMask is going to pop up, it's going to cost me 38 cents on from the Binance Smart Chain, and here we go, alright, so I'm going to be going through all these processes, approve the bridge, Actually, to be honest, I did this a little earlier, and uh, it did take a decent amount of time. It took almost 20 minutes, so I wouldn't panic. Um, I've used a lot of different bridges, and uh, I thought this one was actually quite slow, but I was always happy to do a little bit at first just to test it out, so then you don't panic. Um, so I know what to expect. I'm only sending $20 at this time. So it's not, it, it would be terrible if I lose it, obviously, but uh, it's not the end of the world. Okay, so let's have a look. Looks like that's gone through. So now I'm going to switch on over to the Harmony 1 chain. Harmony, okay. All right, and looks like that BUSD has arrived. 
Okay, so there you go. Um, my B U B S C B U S D has arrived. So if I now go on over into DeFi Kingdoms and go to the map, and I want to go to the marketplace. Okay, and I do some trading. Oh, yes, I do. I do have it. It has arrived. So I can get that. And now I can change that to dual token if I want to. All right, so there you go, guys. Um, that was a very, very, very simple um, tutorial. I hope that comes in handy. And by the way, you will need some one token before you actually can do any transactions on Harmony, okay? And you can buy the one token through um, these exchanges here, okay? And uh, if that's not so difficult, not so difficult at all, but when you send that those one tokens to your MetaMask address, you can't send it to the ETH address. What you need to do is copy that address, then go to the Block Explorer, then go to the Harmony Block Explorer, okay? And what you do is you paste in your address here, and that will give you a Harmony address, this one here, okay? And you copy that, and when you go to the exchange, sorry, and when you go to the exchange, the exchange that you are using, then make sure you send it to that address, not to your ETH address. Otherwise, it will be lost. Okay. And if you do need a little Harmony One token, a little, just to get you started, um, please write a comment, and I'll send you a little, just to, just for you enough for your first transaction. Um, and then after that, you can exchange some of your tokens that you bridged over and for, for the Harmony One token yourself. Okay, and if you do need that, just um, send me a message through YouTube. Okay, and I'll, I'll do that for you. Okay, everyone, I hope you enjoyed today's tutorial. Very, very simple tutorial, but still very, very useful. Anyway, thanks very much. And please don't forget to like and subscribe and leave a comment if you can. Thank you very much and see you next time. Bye for now.